All right, we are here for new adventures with Ear for You, and today we are going to Capital City Comic Con. Yeah. All right, we made it to the exhibit hall. <laughs> wow, look at the <laughs> Look, I found <laughs> thought Mike Wazowski. Oh, I guess that was a fake bathroom. All right, let's head out of here for a moment so I can run to the bathroom. <laughs> here you can play some games, which is pretty cool. Uh, we have <laughs> no little sticky kids touch that stuff. Yes, little sticky kids do touch that kind of stuff. Yeah, I don't like little sticky kids. <laughs> All right, but I gotta go potty. Oh, uh, let's go up that one. <laughs> Rowan. <laughs> the mystery, the mystery man. All right, I think with that we're about ready to start. <laughs> There's Kit. Yeah. Kit. There's Ashton's costume. <laughs> And there's Rowan's. I lost Isla. Oh, there she is. And Isla's just a sweet girl. <laughs> All right, so I just met Tim Allen. Tim Arnold. <laughs> um, from Roseanne, and of course a bunch of other things. Um, it was cool to say hi. They were trying to hawk their pictures, but it was cool to just see them. So tell us about your costumes. I'm Black Rock Shooter from Black Rock Shooter Down. All right, and how about you? Oh, Sonia Nevermind from Dang on Rome Part 2. Oh, wow, you're beautiful. Thank you, lady. All right, Isla, how's that, um, how's that pretzel, Isla? Well, <laughs> they have a little snack bar here with pretzels and pizza and drinks. Look at this awesome Deadpool Pikachu. Very cool. Sully is out and moving around. <laughs> oh, he talks. There is a prison in there. <laughs> Let's see if we can get around to the front. And there's Pooh Bear. <laughs> Say hi, Sully. Hi. <laughs> You're very tall. <laughs> <laughs> Only five foot six. Only five foot six. Yeah, I see the mask right here on my chest. Uh huh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Very cool. Thank you. Ow! <laughs> I wonder if they're screen powered or laugh powered. <laughs> Look over here. We got a cool robot guy. I don't know the firm. V9 Robot Builders Club. Very cool. Lost in space. All right. 
That, that needs to be on your man movie watch list. Probably. Hulu? Okay. I'll make sure. Really? All right. <laughs> Thank you, guys. <laughs> we did not get a super tiny book. Thank you. I have enough to go around and share. So anyway, that guy's still with the person. Yes, show me your person. You guys, like, he won't, like, see, the part of a club, a club where they go to charities and oh, all that. Oh, very cool. So they, they do some good talk. I'm, I won't be eating it, you know? Yes. There's the abominable. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> up close. <laughs> oh, and there's Mike Wazowski. Oh, and there's the Randall. Got to watch out for him. <laughs> Do you have any snow cones? Uh, I did, and they all kind of melted. Yeah, it's a little too hot here for them, isn't it? Oh man. <laughs> Who are you dressed as? Live Love. All right. <laughs> okay. I'm Umi from not an anime, but she's a vocalist, and so is me from here. Yeah. Oh, very nice. Great job, ladies. Thank you. I'm dressing up as Raphael. That's my favorite Ninja Turtle. Dr. Rob from Naruto. Ah, Naruto. Very nice. Thank you, guys. Do you want to tell us who you are for the blog? Templar. Templar. Very nice. And did you make the shield yourself? Nice. And the helmet, too? No. Ah. <laughs> Gotcha. Well, thank you. All right, so what's your company? Uh, I'm just me. I'm an author. Uh, oh. I'm a Michigan-based author. I do children's books and urban fantasy novels. Nice. Um, my books are about uh, social anxiety, anti-bullying, transgender inclusivity, death and grieving, and more. Uh, my novels are urban fantasy reverse portal, and I just started doing 1920s tar cartooning. Very cool. And let's see, Jordan. That's me. How do you say your last name, Jordan? Savard. Savard. All right, very cool. Thanks for talking to yeah. us. Very awesome. Yeah. Mrs. Potts, can I get you for the vlog? Oh, how adorable. Thank you. <laughs> and you got your chip. What is it? Sure. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and she was giving out tea bags. <laughs> Pikachu's got some moves. Can I get you for the vlog? <laughs> so who are you? I'm Oh, and how long did it take you to create this? This took about seven weeks of working every single day. Wow, beautiful. Thank you. Thank you so much. Look, I found my pickle Rick. Oh, what? How did you get that costume? Bo we bought it. Everyone. Hello. <laughs> what did you think of your first con Comic Con? You gotta talk loud. It's good. <laughs> what did you like about it? different costumes and a bunch of different people yeah there were some pretty cool ones what was your favorite costume you saw He's right there. the pickle Rick <laughs> All right. I, I feel jealous now you feel jealous uh, yours is very cool too what did you think of your first comic-con uh, I was a fine <laughs> yeah. but my favorite thing is the pickle Rick <laughs> nice 
I'm terrified for my life. Well, you liked meeting those other Ghostbuster guys. Um, yeah. We can look them up when we get home. Yeah. Uh, like, uh, 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 okay. Yeah, there wasn't quite as much to do as I thought there would be. Yeah, yeah, same. <laughs> More famous people? Yeah, other than Tom Arnold trying to sell his pictures for 40 bucks. <laughs> Which actually is a discount because it was 60, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, good time. We'll get Ashton's opinion a little bit later. All right, we are back home from the Capital City Comic Con. It was good. You know, it was definitely small. I was expecting maybe something a little bit bigger, a little bit more grand. Um, but it was our first experience, so. I probably just had it hyped up in my mind a little too much and you know it was perfectly good a lot of great costumes that we saw a lot of great vendors a lot of really nice vendors and people there um, so i really appreciated that the boys and isla had a great time um, ashton bought a pickle rick costume and then he blew it up it's one of those inflatable ones so he got that ready while at the comic-con and a few people wanted to take pictures with him in it which he thought that was pretty cool so yeah um, so if you're new here at the end of all of our videos we do share a resource um, that's why we're called ear for you so this resource is actually going to be Michigan Pacific I normally try to pick one that's a nationwide resource but I thought a lot of the folks that might be watching this video would be more Michigan local um, being that's the capital city comic-con so this resource is called mission of hope cancer fund so they help with a lot of things related to cancer diagnosis. So if you need help with transportation costs to your, you know, oncology appointments, to your radiation, chemo, you know, they would help with that if you needed to go to the Mayo Clinic because that's where you can get the best care, you know, for something. Um, they could possibly help with part of those costs. So they can do a lot of flexible things um, if you need like supplemental meal programs. So if you need like Insure Boost to raise calorie counts you know that's something that they can help with as well really great organization like I said they can do a lot of versatile things so let me get you that phone number I'm gonna flip you around check out my grass <laughs> all right so mission of hope they are physically in Jackson but they do serve the state and their number is 517-782-4643 and there'll be additional information about Mission of Hope in the description down below. All right, well, thanks so much for tuning in. Please subscribe, hit that notification bell. And we do have a very big adventure coming up here in August. We're going to be doing an Adventures by Disney Southern California trip and an Alaska cruise. So we'd love if you join us. All right, thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.